If someone ever says you're immature, just be like, oh, me? Immature? Sure, just divide this two and then put an apostrophe here and yes, I'm mature. And then show them your butt in celebration of your victory. What the heck? <laughs> Maturity means slightly different things to different people, and that's fine. The problem is when people mistake completely different things for maturity. Okay, time to get up and laugh as little as possible today. Oh, and look down on people who are not as boring as me. Yeah, I, I mean, yeah. Being bitter doesn't mean you're mature, it means you've already rotted. May I have a word with you? I didn't like how you called me bitter and rotted. It's mean. If you get to spend some time with those bitter people who think that they're mature, you'll see that often they're some of the most insecure and immature people you'll ever meet. Does your mom even know you're calling people bitter on the internet? I bet she doesn't. I, I, I don't care. I don't care about that stuff. That's silly stuff that just goes over my head. But I'm just worried about you. I think you should get alive and that's why I'm gonna tell your mom. Because it's for your own good. Call it. Bitter. You're bitter. The basic meaning of maturity is attaining a higher level of development. Aside from people with certain diseases or some medical problems, we all mature physically and mentally. But not everyone matures emotionally. Mom, my wife said I look like a Mexican with this mustache on. Should I pinch her nipple? Emotional maturity can only be obtained with experience. I have seen horrible things. I have seen things I can never unsee. I have seen an old lady poison a young girl. I have seen someone fall off a cliff to their death. I have seen a woman fall in love with an animal. These night movies are killing me. They're killing me, I tell you. That's the thing though. Experience doesn't equal maturity because we all experience things, but that emotional growth happens when you actually learn something from that experience and you apply that lesson to your life. So whoever fits into this shoe is gonna be my wife. I mean, I, I know almost nothing about this girl except she's a good dancer. She has, you know, okay conversation skills and. She smells nice, but she's gonna be my freaking wife, okay? What? What do you mean there's a lot of people that can fit into this shoe? I, I thought that was like fingerprints. Dude, I, I know, for next time I gotta be in better shape because it's pathetic that someone running in these could outrun me. Also, don't let people fool you into thinking that childish fun is immature. Maturity isn't leaving everything you enjoyed as a kid behind. No. Hey sis, I got the Barbies ready. You wanna go play now? Although certain things you might wanna keep to yourself. But I wanna play with Barbie! <laughs> That's immaturity. A lack of control of your emotions. Maturity is being able to distinguish what the limits are in different situations and having the emotional strength to not cross those limits. Don't you dare cross this line. I won't. of how silly you can be at a party are miles away compared to a setting like a funeral for example. I just want to give a toast to Mr. Wrong as his wife used to call him when he was alive. You probably don't call him that now but, but, but he can't have it anyway so does anyone want it? Being mature also means that you can translate those learned experiences into advice for other people or even for yourself. She's been poisoned. Nothing else we, we can do here. Oh, but yes, there is. I just have to kiss her on the lips. No, let me. I'm the professional here and she's kind of hot. If you enjoy childish things, but you can be serious and wise when the moment calls for it, that's true maturity. Enjoying silly things doesn't make you immature. That just means that's the type of sense of humor you have. Okay, everyone, listen up. I have something very important to tell all of you. Penis! <laughs> okay, yeah, that joke is getting pretty flaccid now. <laughs> I 
get called immature all the time due to my videos and yeah, they're pretty silly, but how do I say this in a, the least douchey way possible? So, well, I know exactly where my maturity level is at and that's fine with me. Take your experiences, use them to make you stronger, meditate on the lessons that they teach and apply that to your life. And let yourself enjoy what you enjoy because giving that up doesn't make you mature, it just makes you insecure and bitter. Love you little case, remember to subscribe if you have been at me on Facebook, Twitter, all that business is downstairs. But now I gotta go do my taxes because I'm all grown up like... <laughs> See you later. Crocodile.